Hi, I'm going to test um, the 3G problem um, with the um, iOcean X7, this one, this model, iOcean X7. Um, I've got, I found that it seems that it doesn't support the 3G on the 850MHz. What I'm going to show here, I've got um, three phones, okay, iPhone 4S. And this is one is um, um, another 3G phone. Is this a as a um, MT Care 5877? I think this is an older model, the older CPU than this one. This is a MT Care um, 589 um, something. Um, I can't remember this one, but this is the latest model. Okay. What I'm going to show, I'll go switch the 3G uh, Wi Fi off, and again, you should be able to. Okay. Should be able to see the 3G here. Um, I will take the SIM out. I, was, I can show you the speed test. Um, this one, uh, not this one, this one, speed test. Okay, let's say it's nearly um, to make a bit per second. I will take this sim out. This is a um, 3G on 850 on the DTAC Thailand GSM operator. Okay. I'll put this sim this one, in the adapter. And this one It's very difficult because uh, I'm using the micro SIM adapter to add a normal SIM card. Okay, try again. Okay, there you go. Right, and then the battery. Right on. Okay, it's uh, detecting the tag. Okay, the data connection is off. I changed, and I go to data connection on.
right and uh, you can see on the top of the screen over here that's an edge okay this that mean it's detecting the um, 3G network let's see what I can do I will go to the setting okay settings um, more it's mobile network and 3G service you can see that this is auto mode okay WCDMA only or GSM only what I've changed to um, WCDMA only okay Let's see notice the top of the screen it still detect the HDPA is uh, appears hedge on the top of the screen can switch back to auto mode okay yep meanwhile I'll go to the menu and uh, engineer menu more to see uh, the available uh, network supporting with this device I go to um, this one and I dial dial uh, star hatch star hatch three six four six and six three three and then hatch star hatch star okay it would turn to engineer more what you can see from engineer more I'm going to check the best band here oh sorry not best band um, band mode yeah you can see this one why is shows the head here it's supporting this one WCDMA and uh, 850 what if I check it out and then I click set and click OK right okay it's show still show hedge on the top here what if I remove here and I click set okay I'll uncheck this one and then um, I uncheck this one sorry I have to check this 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 and then I set okay and then I think I should reboot it again right power off okay and then I restart I'm checking that if I um, opened or on the 850 megahertz frequency only will the um, the phone or the this one will support 3g right that's okay what you can see here on the top
it still shows H. That means it's um, working, still working with 850. I'm going back to the configuration in, in engineering mode. So um, you star shop star shop three six four six six three three and shop star shop star okay in engineer mode I'm going to uh band mode what you can see here is only at fifty right so that means the HSDPA on this SIM card it works with wideband CDMA on 850. I'm gonna take this SIM out and then take a uh, test with the um, iOcean X7. Oh, very difficult. Okay. Um, this is iOcean X7. It's except uh, micro SIM card. So I just simply um, insert the SIM card into the SIM card, the first one, the SIM one slot, and. Uh, just put the battery in switch it on Turn off Wi-Fi and um, go to setting. It found the DTAC. Okay, I go to data connection and I switch it on. So now the data is on. I'm going to go to. Um, you can see right on the top here okay. it shows E E here and what I'm going to do I'm going to um, go to setting and uh, more um, mobile networks 3G service, yes, it's a 3G in auto mode. Yeah, I will go to the engineer mode to check the frequency uh, supporting. Okay, I'm going to use this one star sharp, star sharp, um, three six four six. 633 sharp star sharp star yeah going to engineering mode I'm going to go to um probably band mode here that's first sim you can see here is support the same one one band CDMA CLS uh, CRR 850 so it should work with the HSDPA. What I'm going to do, I'm going to unset everything here. And then I click set. Click OK. And I'm going to reboot again.
Yeah. The result is the same. And you can see on the top, it appears E. So it won't detect 3G. Here's the problem. I'll go to um, the settings again. Uh, to the engineer mode. Star sharp, star sharp, and um, three six four six, and six three three sharp. Here, yeah, engineer mode and band mode. Okay, sim one. Yeah, only one band CDMA. You can see here. This one is check, but it still doesn't work with the three G network here. I bought this one for 260 bucks, 260 dollar. I bought this one like years ago for I think less than 200 dollars, but still work fine with the MTK um, chipsets as well. Okay, here's the problem. Thank you.